Check it out. This is the 2HP SEQ 16 Step Sequencer Module from 2HP. The SEQ has got them four, count them, four playback modes, including forward, reverse, pendulum, and random. It's solidly built, much better than you think for a sequencer this slim. An eight LED display provides clear feedback for each parameter, though you'll definitely need to read the manual before you get started. All steps must be active all the time, so you can't have steps one, three, and five activated and not two, four, and six. It's all or nothing. While I love to have this, it's par for the course. Portamento is available, and using a combination of knobs and switches, you can select between eight different preset scales, seen here. Two things to mention to avoid overtime. First, I found it a little hard to install into my pack Euro rack. The power lead is awkwardly placed on the side of the module. Honestly though, I couldn't think of a better place for it. Second, the tuning and quantize mode wasn't perfect. Stephen Hensley of 2HP reminded me that different oscillators track differently. And once I used it with my Mother 32 instead of my SV1, I found the tuning to be spot on within one octave. If you like your modules anorexic, functional, and ultra versatile, look no further than the 2HP SAQ. What they were able to fit into this fine form factor is freaking fantastic. Thanks for tuning in to the first episode of Modular Minute. Before I go, I wanted to announce the winner of the Gakken SX150. Drum roll, please. And the winner is Future Solo. Thanks to everybody who entered on Instagram. Remember, subscribe to me for more future giveaways. Thanks for tuning in. I'll see you next time.